Okay, so we're going to go over um, kind of just ask you questions and you're going to give me your honest uh, response back on how much better these symptoms are from before you started to where you are now. You came in with chronic Lyme and a bunch of co-infections. You did the standard heavy-duty antibiotics. You even did some stem cell treatments. Mm -hmm. So um, lower GI, how much better is that on a scale of 1 to 10 compared to when you came in? 10 is 100%, 5 is 50%. Eight. 80%. Okay. How about focus? 80%. How about um, multiple chemical skin reactions? Oh, that's like 90%. My husband laughs because now I'll walk. If we go to Whole Foods or if I run into shop right to get something, I would totally avoid the detergent section because if I walk down the aisle, you would see hives on my face. Yeah. Now, like, I can walk through and I'm like, Babe, did I break out? You know? So once again, it's usually never about the chemicals. It's about the, your ability to yeah. process the chemicals coming in because they're all over the place. Yep. So that's good. So that's a sign of improved immune modulation. Mm -hmm. Memory? 90%. How about GERD, acid reflux? 80%. Anxiety? 90%. I don't even, I don't feel anxious at all unless like today that I'm Okay. Doing a retirement party. <laughs> How about um, frequent urination? Um, 80%. Body swelling? Uh, my body doesn't swell at all anymore. Since that salt, uh -huh. like, I'm telling you, I don't swell. This ring, this was my original wedding band that was small on me. They actually had to put, like, little balls in there for it so to... tighten it up. Yeah. Okay. So my hands are not swelling at all. So what do you give it? What percent? A hundred percent. Okay. How about pain? I don't feel pain like anymore. Before I would feel pain in my hands. Um, I would wake up and try to take a shower and have to go lay back down because my body was just in so much pain. I really don't feel pain anymore. And I have to tell you, I was here twice this week and on the first uh, on Monday when I was here. Um, I had pain in my neck, but it, I guess it was radiating to my head, mm -hmm. but I'm taking care of my grandma right now and she can't walk. So it's pulling her up and my C2 and my toxic bone were out of line. Mm -hmm. By Tuesday, he did what he had to do. Tuesday, I was like 100%. So how much better is the pain? Oh, overall? 100%. Okay. How about lightheaded? I still feel that every so often. Um, I don't know. I'm, I'm eating every two hours, but yet I'm, I'm still feeling that I was going to actually talk to you about like, in my mind, I'm like, maybe I'm becoming a diabetic. I don't know. Um, that, we'll that's do, something that we can do a me. blood pressure test and I can tell you if there's something going on where we can help you support that. Is it any better at all? It is better before I would feel it and I would immediately sweat. And I thought like maybe it's anxiety. But I would feel it just sitting in my office at work. That's the brain, the hypothalamus, pituitary, adrenal axis. So, so how much better would you say it is, though, if it's any better? 70%. Okay. And then we can figure out how to get that higher. How about energy on a scale of 1 to 10? 100%. I can stay up till 12 o'clock. I remember I emailed you maybe three months into my journey. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I was like, oh, my God, I stayed up past 10. Because... I do remember that. 8.30... I'd have to go to bed. Like I was telling Rian that if I woke up this morning, because she's like, what if you come at 6? I'm like, if I wake up at 6, I can't last till 11 o'clock at night. Okay. You know, so I still struggle with, I have to, well, not wake up at 6, be here for 6, which means I'd have to wake up at 3.30. <laughs> so, okay. but, you know, there's, I still struggle with certain things. Like I actually have to think about how many hours of sleep am I getting. But... Overall, it's 80% 80, 80 better. Good. How about um, shallow, rapid breathing? 80% better. Heart palpitations? 90% better. Um, irritable and moods go off with your cycle? 90% better. Okay. And how would you rate the care you're getting on a scale of 1 to 10? 10 is the best. And if it's not... Ten, tell me what we can do to be better. Fifteen. <laughs> you guys are awesome.